7.47 a.m. Saturday morning, the, what is it, 25th of October, 2014. So it's the 2014 Beachy Head Marathon. We're in Polgate. We've just had, you know, done the necessaries in the loo. I think you know what we're talking about. And uh, we're on our way. We should get there in time for registration. <coughs> All things good, we're going for four hours. Well, at least some of us are going for four hours. I'll probably finish in five hours. Mark. Hello, Mark. Morning. I haven't had a food this morning. Well, not here anyway. I've had one of the in my inhaler. <laughs> I've got no idea why I'm telling your camera about my poo. Um, I'll, I'll be editing that out. <laughs> three, three, poos. Three, three poos for Richard. <laughs> three poos. I'm, I'm not going into any details, but I'm fine, ready to go. So. <laughs> That's Grant. So let's go, let's go, let's go. Back drop. 20, 15 minutes away from the start. Boys. <laughs> Jevington Village, I think we're pretty about four miles. Just coming up to Alfriston Village, about nine nine and a bit, nine and a half maybe, miles, and it's uh, one hour twenty. Just coming out of Halfriston village, um, big steep hill here so I'm going to walk it. About nine and a half miles, I reckon. Grant is about 50 feet in front of me, 50 meters in front of me, maybe. Richard. Sorry? Well, on and off, yeah. Richard, don't know how far ahead he is. Miles ahead by now, I imagine. And I don't know how far Mark is behind. Not doing too bad, but I feel I did probably go off too fast at the beginning. I still don't feel like I've recovered from the very first hill. Twelve point two miles. So I don't think we're going to, I don't think I'm gonna do them in four hours. Because it's one one forty nine now, another mile. But I'm not gonna do I don't think I'm gonna do the second half in two hours. And anyway, I'm enjoying it, it's nice. Just a bit of banana. Let's get running again. We're looking after each other. Mark has caught me up because I went off way too fast. And I started 20 minutes late. Grant is way ahead now. God knows where Richard is. Water. He's going to finish in about 3.45, I reckon. Water. We'll, we're we're going to just dip under four or maybe hit four and 4.15. We're on target for four at the moment. That'd be good, but there we are. Oh, look, buns and everything. Oh, Is that a cup of tea?
I've got a cup of tea. Oh, you're Boy, you're having it, are you? <laughs> yeah. But I'll tell you what, I'll dedicate this one to my uncle John. We buried him to this song. Oh, really? Yeah, great. I guess everybody films on their GoPro at this point because this is when everyone's walking, apart from this fella here, look. Well done, mate. 17 and a half miles. Uh -huh. And uh, pretty heavy going. There's Marky Mark. Ice cream. Oh, love one. Thanks, guys. miles in, three hours, ten minutes, but I'm really screwed now. Feels like I've been walking for ages now. Getting a bit cold. But I've just got no energy in my legs. Still five miles to go. 21 miles in, three hours and 40 minutes. So. There's Bell 2 Lighthouse up there. Three miles to go. Maybe do it in sub five, who knows? So hard work now. That was the closest I've ever come to pulling out of a marathon at that last checkpoint. I just thought to myself, I literally cannot pull myself any further. <laughs> that half a mile to go. I, I, I will edit, just, I'll edit that bit now, don't. I need to know, I need to know at this point, how do you feel about Brecken? Do you know what? <laughs> right, it's the right moment in time. Right, no. I'm shitting myself. Wow. I found one hill. I found myself. Oh, really? Were you going that ladder? And you still did 3.55? My God. Look what I've got. That's mine. And that's mine. And I'm getting, and that's, that's mine. That's Grant's. And I'm getting more. 